we take a look at this chart. This is the strength of the yen and the weakness of the Aussie. Or the liquidation, if you will, in the Aussie. Look at this. 400 pips in three days. From 84 to 80 in four days. An average of 100 pips a day. So we always have to take a look at the weekly chart so we can see what's going on. Again, this is this setup over here. This is a, a shorting setup or a turtle soup setup, like what we call. Okay, so we should be looking for a test of the 8040. That's our structure point, the 8040, and if it does trade below the 8040, then that's a major sell signal. So our structure is short. Is the sell? You see, we had it here from last week. The chart structure short is the 80, uh, 40, and we were short from 82, 86. So let's see our buying point here. If there is a buying point. Any move to the upside over here, guys, this is, again, this is like a short covering rally. We're looking to go short. So we can go short. This is a little bit on the tricky side because the law of the day is 8076 and the structure point is 8040. So you only have a 30 pip move before it will find initial support. So, I guess you want to be rather cautious about the Aussie end, or you have to take it. I mean, there is no, you trade what you see. If it breaks below the low of the day, if it does trade below 80.76, you want to take it. But if it gets to the 80.40, you just want to keep an eye on what happens. So, and your structure point is the 80. Structure short. There's no structure long here. The structure long is still the 8540. Okay. Uh, okay, guys. All right. <laughs>